I know what you think when you uh, plan a travel for an unknown city or it's your first time to go to that city in specific. I know that is uh, nobody, no one on that city and just go and explore. So for here Puerto Vallarta, let me tell you that it's very safe. And this video is about, is about what you must not stay only on the resort. You are losing money just staying on your resort. Your vacation, there are not a, a cost, it's an investment for you. So why you stay only on the resort? Why do you go out and explore Puerto Vallarta? Stay in this video and I'll show you what you are missing just staying on the resort. But before, remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel, activate all notifications, forget the latest news here in Puerto Vallarta or Nuevo Vallarta. Once again, follow me on my social network, Tours uh, Direct on uh, Instagram, follow me, please. And on uh, Facebook, my fan page is Tours Excursion Vallarta. Remember, I have now TikTok, the same Tours Excursion Vallarta. And it's a Telegram channel, Tours Excursion Vallarta. It's only for my customers, exclusive. Uh, and the scones for you, okay? So stay tuned. Okay, friends, I know there is um, an unknowing about the city and a fear about uh, the security in Puerto Vallarta or in another place that you would not travel. Uh, you must do the research, you must study uh, the city or uh, decide what resort is the best. And if you don't have any help or any travel agent, is more difficult to do by yourself. It is nice to uh, meet someone that uh, can help you with all this kind of information and it's more easy for you to stay and enjoy your vacation in one place that you decide to visit. Like in Puerto Vallarta, it's a small city but offer a lot of things that you must do here in Puerto Vallarta. You can visit the north, in Nayari, there is another state, but we are uh, like together, uh, the both cities. And together, Puerto Vallarta and Nuevo Vallarta, Nayari, uh, we make the Banderas Bay. All It's a big uh, bay. Uh, at the north is Punta de Mita, and the south is Boca de Tomatlán, Las Animas, Yelapa, and another town. So it's very important that you know if you go to visit to Puerto Vallarta to plan your activities, but 99 of the people only spend all their vacations, all the days of their vacation on the resort. That's a big mistake. You're losing money because you must invest in you. Staying in the resort is just like a, you are here in a new place and you're not exploring. That's a mistake. That's an awful mistake. So, uh, what is uh, the problem? You don't know the city uh, and you are insecure about uh, the, how is the security here, the violence here in Puerto Vallarta. Let me tell you, Puerto Vallarta is very safe. Uh, especially the parts or the touristic areas are very safe. But uh, what about to explore another parts of this uh, town, this paradise? Well, you have uh, several options, like go to the north and visit uh, Bucerías, Nuevo Vallarta, uh, La Cruz de Guanacaxle, Punta de Mita, Sayulita, and San Pancho. That, these uh, are like micro destinations that you must enjoy in your next visit here in Puerto Vallarta. Uh, but, but this is one part. Now, then you have the, the, the center, um, the, the the downtown here in Puerto Vallarta and obviously there is the boardwalk uh, you have a nice beaches see my la latest, uh, latest video there is uh, several beaches here in Puerto Vallarta like Playa Los Camarones uh, the, Holy, the Holy Beach uh, Los Muertos Beach uh, Los Muertos Beach right now is on fashion it's, you must to visit over there 
that is an a nice beach, but you must go to the boardwalk. But on the boardwalk, you can go and up or climb to the overlook uh, La Cruz, El Cerro de La Cruz is a mirador, it's an overlook. So, and it's free. So, and if you're in the downtown, you can go to the municipal flea market. And on the municipal flea market, you can find a lot of souvenirs, t-shirts, a uh, couple of uh, coffee, uh, a lot of things. But in the second floor, there is a several restaurants for authentic Mexican food. So it's amazing how uh, is the offer of the gastronomy here in Puerto Vallarta. If you stay in your hotel, you are missing all this. Why? Because I don't pay anything for food. But sometimes, believe me, the food in the resort, on the all-inclusive resort, it's awful. Go outside, enjoy the restaurant, enjoy, enjoy the stand food, the street food, or go to, uh, to the south. The south for me, as local, as like almost 30 years living here, is the best, uh, best beaches at south. It's amazing. If you go to uh, uh, Playa Gemelas or Gemelas Beach, or if you go to Conchas Chinas, to Amapa, uh, or more to the south, you go to Boca de Tomatlán, and then take the boat to get to Las Animas, to get Majahuitas, to get Quimisto, and go to the waterfall, uh, 40 minutes hiking on Quimisto to the waterfall, or, or a ride mule, or if you go to Jalapa, it's a little uh, town over there. This, uh, this place is only reachable by boat. So it's a great adventure. You can explore Colomito, the smallest beach in all Jalisco State. And the water is crystal, it's green, blue water. It's amazing the colors of these waters and are the, the best beaches here in, in, in Puerto Vallarta area. So you're missing all this. Uh, you're missing a nice sarandeado fish. You're missing a nice um, cocktail or shrimp cocktail. You're missing a nice octopus on the beach, on a paradise beaches here in Puerto Vallarta. Maybe your resort has a nice beach, but all these places, you are missing it in your visit, and you have only a few days. So make a great schedule of your vacation. Uh, if you need more information, just ask me about to visit this place, and we can schedule your vacation better because uh, you're already here, so spend your vacation in only the resort is a bad idea. And see this picture that I, that I show you, it's amazing to stay in Sayulita, it's amazing to spend the day on San Pancho, it's amazing to spend the day on Las Animas or Quimixto or Yelapa. So this is my recommendation on this video, explore. So there is a lot of information on my YouTube channel, a lot of information on my website. You need to book some trip, some ex uh, or explore or do some adventure. Just email me and I give you more information. It's okay if you are not with me, I can give you direction for go to uh, the Overlook of La Cruz here in Puerto Vallarta. It's free, you can do it for free. I can tell you how bus to take to get to Boca de Tomatlan or go to the north to uh, Asayulita or San Pancho, there are very uh, safe places. Or you want to do with me on my car, we can do that. We, I can help you with that. I have a lot of customers that had a great time with me enjoying this city. So why do you stay only in the hotel? So that's only losing money. Okay, the resort, you think you are safe. Uh, I'm, I have everything here. The, the resort is very nice, but you never try the ceviche on the street food. You never try the fish on a stick. You never try um, a tuba. You never try a tejuino because that on the resort is not available. Some beverage or some, um, some food. Or you don't hear the mariachi live because in, uh, in uh, several restaurants on the Los Muertos Beach, there is uh, mariachis playing for people that want to enjoy that music. So what are you waiting for? So just give me a favor, explore Puerto Vallarta, explore the north, explore the south. It's amazing. Um, and don't waste your vacation only doing 
want to or just stay on your resort believe me okay well that's all for now my friends thank you very much for watching me again uh, you have any uh, question about Puerto Vallarta information I'm here uh, I can, I'm glad to help you and thank you for your donation thank you for your support see you next time bye bye